Welcome back to the vlog. Today I am down in the shop and today I'm doing a lot of computer work. I need to get the stock that's in the shop onto the website. I need to order stuff for the shop. A lot of people have been asking for links to the website. There will be a link in the description, but there's not a lot on there because I've, I've just not had time to put the stock onto the online shop. So that's today's job, which I'm going to start doing. Um, with that, for the subscribers, I'm going to do like subscriber only deals as well. So for example, if a person buys a dozen balls, I might give three free if you put in the comments uh, subscriber of the channel and your name so I can check it. That's not a definite yet, but it's what I want to do. So that's that's the plan with the shop, online shop, is to give the subscribers of this channel something of a deal if I can possibly do it. The other thing I'm going to start next week is the giveaways. So um, I'm going to start it based on a parameter. So 5,000, 10,000 views, etc. Going to start off small, but hopefully if I can get some traction with that, companies may give me stuff to give away as, as well, which would be nice because ultimately you guys watching this are giving me um, an income to, to a degree as it grows. So I want to give something back to you for taking the time to watch my videos. The other thing I need to do today is I've got a lot of editing. I've got about 11 videos I need to start editing. I've got part six of the Dan and Lester course vlog to do today to get that series completed. Um, it is a nail bite and finish, so make sure you watch that. And if you haven't watched it, go back and binge watch it. Next week um, is, I think, Dan's releasing the amateur in the eyes of a pro videos. Now that isn't Dan caddying for me. Like he knows my yardage, he knows my clubs, tells me what to do that is me playing the shots Dan would play um, some of them <laughs> are a little bit like what what are you asking me to do so you need to watch that it's very interesting I've Dan's edited that and I've watched it back um, and I found it interesting even though I was the person involved in it because Dan goes through and explains his theories why he's thinking these shots um, and then he explains like why I can't necessarily pull them off and my emotions as I'm going through it and things for me to work on. So it's a really good series to watch. It's a three part series, it's nine holes. So it would just be something interesting and something different. And I think that's uh, what Dan brings sometimes is something different when he does his videos. Week after that will probably be the Whitsand Bay course vlog that I've still yet to edit. So ultimately, um, the new laptop has arrived. Here it is. Uh, it turned up a day later than it should do, but Wow, so quick, so quick. It's faster than Usain Bolt, this thing. So it will speed up my efficiency when it comes to editing and website things. Um, and I'm gonna spend, sort my time out. Whereas if I'm not working with Dan, I'm gonna be in the shop from nine till four, editing uh, and doing shop work. And then when I get home at four, I can spend more time with Victoria, the kids when they're here, family, and then, uh, put an hour by in the evening just to edit this vlog ready for the morning release. So that's my plans for today. I'm going to show you the shop because it's almost finished. Um, it's pretty tidy so I'm going to show you a quick quick tour of the shop to show you what it's like and then next week uh, hopefully I can get it into a place, get some stock in ready for the 15th of June which is what I think will be the day we're allowed to officially release. I've had the Cleveland Woods and Hybrids and Drivers uh, come in yesterday day before so i'll show you them really surprised by the quality of those for the price for the price i just don't think there's anything better um, i'm yet to test it i'm going to go into the sum and test that at some point as well and do a quick review on it and then i'm going to get it down to dan and get it on the saturday showdown um, up against something of his choosing so they will be my choices but ultimately i've got work to do so i'm going to get down and do it uh, and i'll be back in a bit Right, so let's show you around the shop a little bit then. That's where the second hand clubs, new clubs are going to be. Then obviously we've got the simulator, the fitting area. Uh, we've had these in now and these are arguably some of the best looking cheap clubs I think I've seen. For the value, I just think they look stunning. And from the top as well. From the top, I just love that matte black finish and the like turbulators and everything. It's just, uh, just for the money, I think these things look stunning and I'm looking forward to getting these into the studio and testing them out. Uh, maybe testing that out against uh, like my TS4 or something and see the, the difference in value for money. Because I think that's important is testing, although you can test it 
for distances and spin rates and stuff, but like on a personal level, it's only going to be relevant for me when I test it because it's me using it. But can I use something that's £200 cheaper than the driver I'm using? You know, what is £200 getting me? And then obviously the clothing, the bags, uh, the balls, and then we've got the potting area with X put on the wall there. Uh, looking down at the mat and then we've got the studio area which is pretty much the, literally the last bit I need to tidy um, otherwise as a shop it's pretty much there or thereabouts now just need to get some stock in so I think I've learned a massively valuable lesson today and that is do not even upload to YouTube from the shop because the internet is complete and utter trash I've been sat here for four hours waiting for it to upload and it is still not done. I've wasted my day that I wanted to do more editing, I wanted to do website stuff, waiting for this to upload. So, top tip, edit at the shop, upload when I get home. I am not doing that anymore. The BT here is appalling. Um, I don't even know if I can change it. I might see if I can get Virgin in or something like I've got at home, because BT is utter and crap complete rubbish so it's still not done and if it's not done in half an hour I'm cancelling it and when I get home I'll do it so half the things I wanted to get done for the vlog today I couldn't do because I wanted to hit some balls into the sim but Skytrack wouldn't load because this is using all the bandwidth up that the internet has got so literally achieved nothing apart from editing one vlog catalogued everything in the shop onto the POS system so it's all barcode scanned into the system now which will ease use when we open up uh, and let people come in and buy stuff because it, although it's appointment only a lot of the time i will be here so i'll just put a post on facebook saying open all day otherwise i'll be at dan's and it'll be bookings only so that's helped but half the stuff i wanted to do i couldn't get into skytrack i couldn't do the website it's just really annoyed me i suppose that's what happens when you upload in 4k i guess it's uh just takes its time I suppose I'm gonna go home shortly. Uh, it's nearly four o'clock, so I'm gonna go home, see what Victoria's been up to. I think she's been ironing all day and decide what I'm gonna have for tea. If she's not got anything out, I'm, I'm feeling a bit of a curry tonight. So I might talk her into getting a curry delivered because I can't be bothered to cook now because I'm annoyed. I'm sure she probably doesn't wanna cook unless she's planned something already. So curry, beer, and de-stress. So come out for a walk with Heidi girl. Where is she hiding? Uh, she's hiding somewhere. She doesn't want to be in it. She sees. <laughs> she's like, I'm not being in it. I'm ugly today. What are you hiding for? <laughs> so I come out for a walk to cheer myself up because I was annoyed at the internet. I got home, put that up to upload. It took 22 minutes. Just stupid, absolutely stupid. Four hours of 22 minutes. BT, sort your crap out. So come for a walk with Boson, come to a different wood. Is it a different woods or is it the same woods? Different woods, so much to do. And then I'm gonna get home and order that curry. We're having curry, babe. Mm -hmm. Nice chicken tikka masala. What are you having? Um, chicken tikka masala. You having CTM as well? Well, we have biryani, don't we? I don't know why she doesn't want to be in it. She looks no different to what she did the other day. So we're coming to throw the ball for the dog, go home and order a, ch a curry, and then hopefully get some more productive. I'm playing golf tomorrow in a four ball better ball. So we'll see how it goes. Lee's found a toy. No, it's a daddy toy. <laughs> we're hoping it's gonna snap. <laughs> <laughs> Bose, watch out the way, Bose! Oh, you <laughs> It's because he likes to play on them. Can we just stay here? Stay! 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 <laughs> Get it! Get it! Yeah, I'm it! Good, Marcel. Let go, leave it. Any chance, Bose? I told you, try and get in away, try and get in away from that. Amazing. Bose, any chance? 
No? Person's found another swing. Any chance this time? Right. Bows? Can we go? Bows? Bows then? Come on. Ugh.